How's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me. Welcome back. So today I just wanted to do a chit chat video um, and that's about basically it. Um, just a chit chat and maybe just show you a couple of things. Nothing really beauty related but um, just a couple of things that I just wanted to so share with you guys. The reason why I can't is because the video, the Vote It Girl video that I entered for It Cosmetics. Um, actually, because like I had seen them posting on um, Twitter and different things and telling people that it's not till the 26th. Uh, so I, I, I will admit, cause like I've never entered a contest before. So some of the rules were a little, I was, I was uncertain and I've seen other ones putting theirs up and I thought, oh, okay. So yeah, we're allowed to put them up yet or now. So if you did see the video up and then all of a sudden it's gone, I had to set it on private and double check on some things um, as I go to. I wanna make sure I do by the rules and be fair. I don't want to be unfair to anybody else. I think it's it's a fun thing to just do in itself. And I think, you know, everybody has a shot and a lot of them I'm sure are gonna come up with wonderful, great ideas and um, you know, what they have to say. So I just thought I'd bring it to your attention that you won't see my video up until I think it's like gonna be like Friday at midnight. Uh, so because like June 26th is technically when you start um, the whole putting your video up and people liking it and commenting on it or just whatever. Um, I really would appreciate it though if you all could give me your support and share. Uh, they do ask to put hashtag vote it girl on there and um, <clears throat> you can share it on your media. I think mostly like Twitter and just different things like that. Um, and you know, the more likes that I get, the more views I get, I can go to the second round, which the second round will consist of 20, um, ladies and gents that, um, go to the next, uh, level of whatever they want you to do. I do believe you can win some It Cosmetic products. Um, I think it's like $800 worth. It's quite a bit. Um, so I'd even be excited and ecstatic over that in its own self, but, um, for the chance to even be going to New York and the whole thing with the $5,000 cash in New York, but, you know, it just sounds all great. And, um, you know, it's just something I really would like to do. I would like to work with a company if I can. I mean, I'm putting myself out there, put it that way, you know, but I'm not going to be bummed if I don't win. I mean, I'm just proud of myself for just even doing this whole thing, you know. Um, so I'm not sure I'll have to find out more because, um, um, I had contacted them back to ask them some more questions just to be sure I'm understanding correctly because like I said, I want to be fair. Um, I want to make sure it's fair because from what, uh, from what I'm understanding, if you keep your video up and people are still liking it and just different things, then you can be, you're not going to be eligible to be judged is what it is. They, no, you, you can turn everything in and do whatever, but they're not going to judge you because the one, one of the rules is um they want to have it on the 26th so i had thought that originally but like i feel like my nerves and my excitement got the best of me and then when i seen other people posting it up i just you know but lesson learned i am not gonna like whatever that you know like next time i see other people do it you know no i'm not gonna do it next time um next time i'm gonna go with my gut feeling they always say go with your gut feeling and that's what i'm gonna go with so, um, sorry I keep rambling on about it, but uh, I just figured I'd let you know that, yeah, you did see the video and then it was gone and I set it on private. June 26th, please look for my uh, Vote It Girl video, will be up. So, and I'm not sure if, like I said, I'll be having it changed or I have to change it or anything. Um, because I think it does go by views and likes on top of it all. So, um, yeah, I know. I, that my chances for that, I'm a little nervous because I don't quite have my channel grow, but you know, might help it grow. Um, as people maybe might discover me that so way. So the other thing know. is, I just thought I'd come on here and chit chat. I'm gonna put at the very end. Um, I actually have the same outfit on. I'm not sure. Well, I'm, this video will probably go up first. But I do have a video that I'm gonna be putting up. That's a gift and haul video. Um, Rosa Beauty Fashion had sent me some gifts for my birthday, so I'm going to be having that video coming up here within this week, too. And, um, so you can see what she got me, and then I got a couple of items from, um, 
Alta. I wanted to put my son on at the end of the video with my haul and my gifts and stuff, but it was too long, so I didn't want to overdo it. So I wanted you guys to meet my son. It is warm. I really need to get my hair sorted. I haven't got it colored, cut, nothing still yet. I have just... <laughs> If it's not one thing, it's another thing. It keeps popping up, so, um, this chicky poo needs to really get her hair done and just, you know, get something vamped up or something. I mean, something. So, I wanted to share with you guys, and this is kind of for Mary Ellen, uh, Sensational After 60. I know she talks about a lot with her family and everything, and... I really love to know a lot of history or learn about my family. So I have some pictures here I just wanted to show. Um, this picture here is very, very special to my heart. And it's a picture of me with my mom and dad. I'm going to say I probably was about 21. I was about 20 or 21 maybe. Here it is. Don't know how well they'll be able. Of course, there I am in the middle, and there's my mom, and there's my dad. He was on dialysis then. That was before he got his kidney. So, oh, there's the three of us. This is one of my favorite pictures because uh, it's one that I have of all three of us together. In a group like that, so I really like that picture. Cousin of mine actually gave it to me. Here's a picture of my mom at my grandma's house. I mean, look how young my mom is in that picture. A lot of people always thought that my mom was Italian or had some Indian in her or something. Um, I get that sometimes. Some people ask me if there's Italian. As far as I know, no, but gosh knows. Oh, don't mind my nails. I was taking my nail polish off and everything. Um, so I really didn't get a chance to do my nails. I'm in the process of figuring out what I'm going to do with my nails. After here of my mom, I'm thinking she might have been 12 or something. <laughs> so that's a picture of my mom there. So, see any resemblance there of any sorts? No, yeah, that's my mom. And then here's a picture of my daddy when he was a little bit more... Um, it's a school photo. I'm not sure how old my dad was there, but there is a, whoops, there is a picture of my dad. Thank goodness. Yeah, that's my dad. Here's some older pictures of, that's my daughter. There's Corinne, my daughter. That's an older picture over there when she was in school. And then an older picture of my son. There's Joshua there. Again. <laughs> I think he has the Gallagher like I, I I don't know. Here's my dad's this I think this is my dad's graduation picture. Handsome. I miss him. So I do. Miss him every day. Um here is me as a baby. <laughs> my mom giving me a bath. Give a little cutesy smile. Here's me and my cousin and my brother. We're all playing at my grandma's. That's me, of course. We're right there. And that's my brother and my cousin Lenny. This is a favorite picture of mine because it's my whole family. Uh, but I was pretty little, pretty young here. We all were, of course. So there's a picture of my whole family here. That's my brother right there. Of course, there's my dad, my mom, my sister, and me. That's one of my favorite pets at my grandma's, too. I used to get at my grandma's a lot. That would be my mom's mom. Here's my grandma, actually, right here. There's my gram. Gosh, I miss her, too. She gave the best hugs. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's that picture over there. I miss her. There's my grandpa. That would be her husband, my mom's dad. Oh yes, my mom and her little curly cues. Obviously, that's where I got my curls from. Look at her showing off her her sexy legs there. 
Oh, that's a cute, funny picture. This is my great grandmother. So my grandma's mom, well, my mom's grandma, my great grandma. And this is who I have tattooed on my back. It's very hard to show the tattoo. I mean, it, it's big, but um, I've always loved this picture. And I've heard so many great things about my great grandma, but there it is there. She was, I believe 16 years old. And it's a copy of it, but oh, I just look at that and just, I can totally see, you know, me and my mom and, um, yeah, just she's beautiful, she's a beautiful woman. And it's my favorite picture, I used to always want to get it in an oval shaped frame. And that's kind of where the whole tattoo came in. Um, I think I did do a video where I showed my tattoo of my great grandma and um, cause it's hard to find an antique oval shaped frame because I, I wanted this blown up like nice and big oval shaped antique frame so that's hard to find oh my goodness this is crazy this is my grandma when she was I think my mom said she was 13 or 16 right there that's my grandma and a friend of hers, I believe, from what I understand. That's so crazy. Oh, it's so cool that I, I have it. I love this picture of my mom. <coughs> I'm not sure how old she was there, but I love that picture of my mom. When she was a little girl. And then my mom said she was never camera shy. <laughs> That's with her and her one brother. I think that's my Uncle Emmett. Uh, mm -hmm. And, uh, yeah, when my dad had passed away, I had a wreath. And I still wish I had that wreath, but I don't. But um, I did get a memorial tribute card that was on the wreath. Um, it has his name in there. Patrick F. Gallagher. That was my dad. And the poem is the, um, and I've heard this many times before, it says, um, do not stand at my grave and weep. I am not there, I do not sleep. I am the thousand winds that blow. I am the diamond glints on snow. I am the gentle autumn's rain. And when you awake in the morning, hush. I am the swift uplifting brush of quiet birds in circled flight. I am the soft stars that shine at night. Do not stand at my grave and cry. I am not there. I did not die. So yeah. seen this or anything you know me I love this lady this lady is a big inspiration and a reason for a lot of things that I do why I started my channel to a degree and there's some other people too that inspired me uh, other youtubers but she inspired me in just a lot of different things in itself and I just love her to bits and this is called love lashes and lipstick my secrets for a gorgeous happy life it has a really nice uh, pictures in here, detail of, you know, certain looks that, you know, she's done, um, some tips and ideas. My mom got me this book, actually, and um, I've been reading it, and it uh, really talks about her and her life as a makeup artist, but it also talks about her life and the loss of her mom with um, cancer. Not sure how well, but so she she talks about her mom in here and just all these, you know, all the obstacles that she came through. I don't know, she kind of reminds me of me on some parts. So here's my son, Joshua, 
and um, I thought I would go ahead and introduce him for the first time on my channel because um, I know you guys hear so much about him. We'll go ahead and take away Joshua. You want to tell him? Oh. He just got back. He got back today actually from the weekend at his uh, Army Reserves and um, he did get promoted. Yeah, actually I did to a uh, specialist so it's, you know, it's no biggie. Just another way to move on up. Yeah, um, he became a specialist <laughs> so instead of him being called, what is it? A private. A private. They always say Private Davis. <laughs> now um, you're a specialist. Specialist uh, Davis. Davis. So, yep. It's a proud of him, <laughs> of course. Yeah, so, but... Sorry for the glare if there is a glare, but one day this wall will be painted or I'll have a background of something better. But um, I guess since uh, I always do favorites or hauls or all that kind of stuff, what's your favorite so far this month that you've been doing? My favorite thing that I've been doing? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know, probably just, you know, some of the times like spend with some of my friends, you know, just moments we had, you know, like. Yeah, uh, well, my friend recently moved to his new house, so, you know, it's just been pretty cool chilling out over there. Um, yeah, that's about it. I don't know, like, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's all I can really say. I, I don't, I don't know, I guess I, I just take each moment as it comes and just, you know, I remember some of it and maybe forget most of it, so I, I right. don't really take the He's time like to, me, I think, sometimes. It's like, yeah, I just... Take each thing in at a time and then just try to grasp it from there. Uh, try, gonna try and get, you know, hubby on here. That's that's gonna be a big challenge on its own self because uh, we're gonna try to do the husband wife tag that I've seen some of you guys doing and you wanted to see him. And uh, I'm sure y'all will be like wondering and like listening to his uh, English accent because um, uh, the majority of you probably know he's from England, but maybe some of you might. New subscribers don't know that, but yeah, he's from England, so. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not too camera shy, on the other hand. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Shame, shameless advertisement for something that's been around, actually. <laughs> um, if you'd ever want to see, like, something that I have done on here, uh, one of my friends, he has this group called Dweebs. I don't know if he still works with that, or if it's just, if he's kind of just let it die since he's been out of school. But, uh, just type in Dweebs, and then the word static and enjoy. I was gonna say actually what I'll do is I'll have him so, I'll have uh, him go on it and then I'll just copy paste the link and I'll put it down below so, so if you guys want to check it out. I did watch a couple of them and it was kind of <laughs> kind of funny. It's, you know, it's good it's for a few yucks yeah so um, I don't know I guess we all have our starts. <laughs> but, yeah that's uh, what like I, I don't know I think they're getting used to me with this whole uh, not just the YouTube thing, but cosmetics thing, because every time, like, I always tell people it's funny because as soon as we go to Walmart, it's, well, my, I don't think my husband even asks anymore, to really be honest, but before he used to always say to me, be like, so, like, where should we go, or where are you going to go? It's like, do you really need to ask that? <laughs> because I'm just, boom, I go right to the cosmetic aisle. What would you say your passion is, or what your favorite? Probably mm -hmm. the gaming itself, or? Probably, yeah, it's my big time hobby. He's actually well, thought about getting into gaming at one point. I don't know if it's still <clears throat> on the list or, or not, but uh, um, he had I, thought I about doing it. I would like to get involved. I guess it'd be my dream to at least like do one where I do like help out with the story or at least just like create my own game altogether, like you know, the design of it and all, but right. uh, you know, even just competing in a tournament. Right. Um, you know, like something more large scale. Like it's it's pretty cool that the local games solve like you know, like one of the managers hosts a few yeah. at a time. Yeah, but he's gotten to do that, the local game stuff. Is there anything else you'd like to add before we go? Uh, well, nice to meet y'all. Uh, <laughs> you know, uh, okay, wear sunscreen this summer. Just, I'm gonna get that out there. <laughs> I'm serious, like, just do it. Because this last weekend, I went kayaking with a few of my friends. Uh, you might barely see it here, but... He does have some... If you can see the little pink tone there... Yeah, you know. it's... You know, we were out there for like five hours, and that sun just cooked me alive. So... Yeah, they were on the... Um, that's why... Ropes, if you saw like, and they itching. jump and whatever uh, on the ropes and everything, so they were doing that kind of stuff. And, yeah, he was... I mean, he looks... 
As you can see, he's still itching, but he, he looks better than what so, he did. So, yeah, sorry if I was, like, diverting my attention away on the itching part. Like, that. <laughs> I tried not to, but it's just, whatever, okay, I'll just... <laughs> yes, it. wear his sunscreen, that is true, because, like, now that I'm older and stuff, I mean, uh, yeah, I regret the days that I used to lay out and put that oil on, like, you know, I mean, you came from my time, like, from in the 60s, you were born in the 60s, and then you started in the 70s and 80s, you were one of the ones that probably had the, uh, <clears throat> baby oil, or, yeah, even the Wesson oil, <laughs> Um, and put that on your body and like hope you fried to a crisp because that was the thing to do and now yeah no I don't even like I mean like I get sun haven't gotten sunburn but uh, even when I went to Atlantic City I had a little sunburn but I, I made sure I didn't overdo myself outdoors or if I do go I'm gonna really start putting sunscreen on because with my tattoo I also have I want to protect it and that's one way to protect it too uh, putting the sunscreen on so but anyway bees thanks for joining us and um yeah i hope you enjoyed the video if you did please give it a good old thumbs up that would help me out so much i really appreciate it and if you are not subscribed to my channel i'd love to have you go ahead and click the subscribe button down below and join me each week and come and see what's going on uh you never know anymore now on my channel what you're gonna have so just come and join me each week and as always please please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and the real beauty you do. So until the next time, y'all take care, and we'll see you then. Bye. Mwah. Love y'all. Bye-bye.